Hi, welcome to Oprah Amster. Today we'll be taking a look at this electric spin scrubber. It's for cleaning tiles or essentially restrooms. Here's the barcode. Have a quick start guide. If you want to read any part more detail, feel free to pause the video. Next, we have a more, think a more detailed manual. I'm gonna show some, just briefly go through this. Just so I have a record of it in case I ever lose my, my booklet here. rest are just FAQs, some tips. It's a USB type A to USB type C power cord or charging cable. Different brush heads. Other brush. The fourth brush head. There's a, I believe this is a telescopic arm. So batteries in this one here, at least this is the one that has the charging port. Turbo. What is this? This one. Oh, power. So it's already got 67%. So this black one, this is just the extension piece, so I can make this longer, but I don't need it to be that long. I'll just plug in this handle one directly into this piece here. And just put in one of the heads. Looks like there's only one way to put in a head. Press a second time. Third time turns it off. I'll press it once and I'll press the turbo. So this is turbo. Alright. Let's look at some of the labels on here. Okay. So I need to go clean my tiles. I think I'll be using this one here just. I scraped off the old caulk, the old gunk that was stuck on the walls, and I sprayed some cleaning solution on it. Let it sit for a while. Now the purpose of such a tool is to essentially have me use less effort. Because before using this tool, I use something like this, just to scrub. After I'm done scrubbing, then I'll re-caulk and everything. But for now, let's try how this works out. Yeah, this one has the orange. Now it's coming. Nice. Clean is very simple. Other than the brush head, the rest of it, I just dry off with a paper towel then for the brush head just pull it off i'll rinse this under the sink let it dry mine is mostly a flat surface but if there are any hard to reach places i can also change the angle of this by pressing here There's three angles horizontal like 45 degree and then 90 degree 
for my clean it needs about 40% of battery. So now it's got 40% left. We'll start off with 67. 110% is for rinsing. So after I'm done with all the scrubbing of the chemicals, I then just run a hose with this to rinse off those chemicals. I'll place a link to this in the description below. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching Awkward Hamster. Bye.